In this video, we will learn the concept of time and work. For our problems, we can define work as amount of job done. Amount of job done. We can link work with the, animal, with the time, speed and distance problem also like work. Work can be measured in term of distance like how much distance covered by a car. So that distance covered by a car is actually a work done by a car. The rate of work done is actually speed and the number of time days number of days or amount of time required to do the work that is time so we can break the problem of time and work into the problem of distance speed and time one thing we need to understand about time and work. If an, a person is taking x time to do a work and another person b taking x y 2 time to do a work then we can say that b person is more efficient is two times efficient than person a. v is two times efficient then A. So to measure efficiency, we can compare time taken by them to complete a work, to finish a work, to do their job. So this analogy, this kind of understanding, like A, A is one day work is one Y nth of B means A is work is 1 by N times of B work done by B so we can set that A B is N times efficient than A so to to understand who is more efficient we can take the help of time to calculate their efficiency. Similar understanding we can develop with some help of some other problems also. In the given problem, Ram and Sam can do a job in 10 days independently. Then how many days they would take to complete a job together if they work together. So let's assume work is W. Ram and Sam can do job in 10 days independently so the speed the rate of work done by ram is w by 10 and that is also speed of the raman so the if they work together the speed will be doubled the speed will be sum of the speed of ram and raman the speed of Ram is W by 10 and the speed of Raman is W by 10. So the total speed will be W by 5. Now total work is W and the speed is W by 5. So it will be 5 days. So if the Ram and Sham will do job together, they can complete the job in just 5 days. So using the analogy of time, distance and speed, we can solve the problems of time and work also. Thank you.